Hello, survivalists. Welcome back to Force of Nature Ghost Keeper. I've been a little busy between episodes. I went ahead and put up a stick gate over here, so now we don't have to worry about... Well, I shouldn't say you shouldn't have to worry about animals coming in here. Um, they could tear it down, I guess. I, don't, I forgot what the structure strength of that is, but at least there's a gate there. That's why we go in and out. As for now, um, over here where our little flower... Uh, flower. <laughs> Yeah, our little seed beds are. Um, I got flowers, I got some uh, grapes growing, and I'm doing some wheat as well. Got them up and going here. I've also been making some embers, do, been doing some coal, and some gathering. So, yeah, I got a whole bunch of coal here. Uh, actually, over here, I got a frying pan, and what I want to do, now I got a frying pan, I should be able to... Uh, I cannot make fried meat? Oh, I gotta put the frying pan... Wait, where's the frying pan? Let's put that into the tools. There we go. I, that one piece of meat that we got last episode, I can now go ahead. I should be able to craft that. There we go. That'll give us some uh, health and maybe some stamina later on. Because I need to venture out and, well, we need to go uh, do some hunting. Uh, yeah, last episode, I was, I was talking about what we need to do this episode. And the one thing I forgot about, yeah, the crafting table. Uh, let's go ahead and build a crafting table because uh, that's kind of important. Let's just go ahead and we'll throw that down, I guess. We'll just put it down right there, I suppose. So also, I don't think I mentioned, some of these uh, crafting areas that we're putting down have different levels on them. So we're going to have to upgrade some of these later on. Obviously, a lot of stuff we don't have. We just started. We just started. So we got to get out into the wilderness and definitely got to find some iron ore. I think it's iron ore I need to go find. But really what I want to find today um, is pelt and leather. Pelt we got last episode. So, yeah, let's go ahead and come in here. Uh, so the trap. Remember I was saying, how do we how we capture animals? And I was like, um, yeah, I need the crafting table to learn how to make a trap. Which is rope and sticks. And now we can do ash. We can do splinters, which we could do before. Copper planes would be kind of a... Uh, well, this tool is going to come important. I need to make some planks at some point. Um, can I make a plank? I need I, any plane. Well, there's a copper plane. Uh, stone mace, which I don't think I have. Stone spear. What's the damage on that? So the damage on that is 8. The attack speed is 1. And stamina spent is 0. 0.75. So 8, 1, 0. 0.75. And this is... Okay, so the... Okay, so that's attack speed of 0. 0.75. S uh, spent stamina is 1. So the spear... is better if i'm not mistaken let's go ahead and craft that up because like i said we need to go out and well we need to do a little bit of hunting i need to get a pelt and some leather because i want to get the uh is it tannery i think i would got to discover the tannery oh wait a second we'll come to discovery ta table in a second to check it on out because i want to go ahead and be able to build some armor for ourselves because right now i got none basically let's go ahead and get ourselves a spear the one thing I'm also noticing, I don't think there was in the first Force of Nature as well. Are, are you attacking my fence? You are attacking my fence. How cruel of you. Wait, where's my spear? Did I not? I didn't grab the spear. Um, yeah, oh, hang on a second here. Where's my spear? Let's go put the spear here. Alright, so my, my stick fence is already... No, right here. Oh, and the spear is a little bit longer. Oh, this is where the bow and arrow is going to come in handy in the future. Please get stuck on that cow. Aha. There we go. Uh, wait, where? Did I pick it up already? Oh, no. That spear seems to do a lot more damage than I remember. Well, I didn't want to come out here until I had to, but here we are chasing. Oh, great. So now I got to... Yep. How's my health doing? My health is doing fine. Alright, I'm getting a little bit too far away from home. But that's, that's fine. Oh, another one. I'm level two. Why is my health going up? My health seems to be going up kind of fast, it seems like. Uh, oh, uh, goblins. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, I went a little bit too far from base, I think. Come here, you. You know what? The heck with you. Heck with you. And you're back? 
No, you're a different one. Okay. <laughs> Seems like my health is holding up better than it has before. Right, let, let's get let's get back a little bit closer to home. I wasn't didn't want to venture out this far, but I need, do need some leather. And let's see, do I need to attack a cow? Maybe. I don't know. Well, let's get let's get back home. Let's bring. Uh oh. All right. Uh, can I get some leather from you? Or are you gonna be pelt? All right. You're you're pelt for some reason. All right. Let's get the map back up here so I can see what the heck I am. All right. We're almost back home. Ah, so not too bad. Actually, I, I held up uh, pretty good compared to the first episode, but my stone, or sorry, my gate fence is uh, not holding up too well. Let's go ahead and close. Now, put my spear away. Close that on up. Inventory is full. Stone spear dropped. Oh, okay, so my inventory is full. Surprise, surprise. Let me come back over here. Do I have room in here? I don't have room in there either. Uh, inventory 101 is something I need to go ahead and let's see that needs nails um, that is bamboo and palm leaf I don't have any of that yet nails nails so probably the bamboo basket is something I need to look into let's get back over here to our crafting table before we were rudely interrupted by that fox attacking our gate um, so a trap uh, cow sheep goose and chickens I gotta remember how to do that. Uh, do I want to make a couple of these? Uh, it's just rope and sticks. Let's go ahead and craft those on up. I don't need to stand there, do I? I do need to stand there. So this is a crafting table I need to stand at while I do that. Okay. We'll make a couple. But now I need some leather, right? So I got pelt, which is nice. Uh, soil still left over. Wheat grains I've been collecting. Can I not go into my... Okay, I can't see the inventory. If I stay in the inventory, it probably would have been better. Collect those. Then we'll put that down in our sixth slot. Um, do I want to capture cows and start feeding them and, and I get no for it? Probably not. But it may not be a bad idea if I can, I suppose. If I remember... <laughs> I don't think the animals are going to die on us if we don't get the chance to feed them. But that was like in the first game. I'm not sure if they change that in the second game here. Let's see, we got eight traps. I think we're making, what, 12 of them? So this should be the last one, I think. And I will go go up and fix my gate. Just because. Just because. Um, should be able to... Nope, I don't want to... I want to repair that. So it has a structure strength of 40. And this was the sticks. That, that's all I uh, needed to go ahead and put this on up. So it didn't hold up too well against that fox. That fox only attacked it for maybe like 15 seconds, 20 seconds. Just about tore it down. It would have been the worst thing the fox got in here. We wouldn't be able to take care of it. All right, that's all set. Where's my stone spear? There, I got my stone spear back. Can we go ahead and put that in my weapon slot? There we go. All right, there we go. And then, okay, now let's go ahead and put that into into there. And right now, I'm trying to, since I don't have much of an inventory, I'm just kind of like dropping things on the ground there. All right, so this is what I wanted to do. Tailoring is what I'm talking about. So I got pelt. I'm out of rope already. All right, and I got to get some leather. Well, leather, leather, leather. Uh, I'm assuming a cow would be something I could go ahead and kill and get some leather. Let's go through here. We'll close the gate behind us. Where is my spear? There was a cow over here somewhere, right? When we're chasing those foxes away. Let's go ahead and get rid of that. And we'll get rid of that for now. Now there is a cow. Maybe I can corner the cow, is what I'm hoping. That cow seems to be a little fast. Alright, I hate to do it to a goose. Let's see what we can do to a goose. Alright, the goose is running too fast for me as well. <sighs> My kingdom for some leather. 
Uh, there is a goblin over here. We'll attack him. Oh, and a fox. And a pig. Alright, uh, no, we don't want the stick. We just want the pelt. Alright, so the animals are just too darn fast for me right now. How am I going to get some leather? Well, I guess I could probably try trapping the cow. If I can remember where the cow went. Trapping the cow with one of our traps and then maybe trying to kill it that way. If I only knew where the cow went. Let's get out one of the... Oh, no, no. There we go. Uh, claw and pelt. My health is getting starting on a little bit on the low side, but I do have that steak meal, I think. No, no, pick that up, pick that up. Let's go to inventory. That's raw meat. Where's that? Did I not pick up the cooked meat out of the fireplace? Ah, oh, man. All right, where are we here? No, need to go this way. Let's get on home before we die. Wait, how did that goose get into my... So the goose can get through there, but I can't? Alright. Alright, since we got a goose in here... Right, so how does this work? Well, the goose can just get right on out, I suppose, so I'm not going to worry about it. Oh, I'll have to work, figure out how to use the traps later on. Um, we did level up. I forgot about that. So let's go ahead and we got some three skill points. Um, let's go ahead and put a point into health. Why not? Uh, stamina, accuracy, crafting. Crafting and construction speed, not a big concern. Let's put one into there. And what does this do? Uh, the hero takes a defensive pose, which significantly increases your armor for a short time. Armor would not be bad. Uh, temporary increases your running speed. Critical damage. Let's go with this one right here. A little bit of defense would not hurt. So my health is already back up. That's interesting. Now let's come down here. I think that's a inventory is full. Yep, inventory management 101. Uh, I don't think I need any logs for a bit. So we'll throw down those logs there. Um, pelt, uh, linen seed, you know, let me throw down the linen seed, hopefully that doesn't disappear. Actually, you know what, I want to pick up the linen seed, because over here, I left out some potatoes before, if one of us still here. I think it was potatoes, and it turned to garbage, so I don't want to leave things that could rot on the ground, because it'll turn into garbage. Um, the claws, I think I can go ahead... Yep, the claws we can put in here. Actually, linen seed I should be able to put in here unless it's going to stack. Can it stack up to 36? It does. All right, that's good. Um, and it leaves me some room. That's fine. All right, so I got my health. We're full of stamina. I'm going to leave that map up for now. I got to find a way to get some leather. Leather, leather, leather. Apple on the ground there. Oh, I don't have my weapon out. Come here, you. And if we venture while we're out here, we find some iron ore, that'll be just fine. The old mechanics of battling them and they start running away. I just don't want to run into too many goblins while I'm out here either. But the spear seems to be doing pretty good because it has a good reach on it. I hear a cow.
And a chicken. Oh, hello. Level three already. Now let's go down here a little bit and let's go down here. Level three. So I can't put another... I can't... Oh, I can't add another point into health until I get to level four. Um... Do I want to add stamina? I'll do sprint. And we'll do critical damage. And we'll do... What's this? Poison resistance. Uh, don't worry about that. Dash. Let's go stamina for now. There we go. Is that a cow? Over there? What the heck's going on here? Alright, I can't get in there. At least not from that way. Oh, great. Goblins behind me. Let's grab that pelt. I'm hoping one of them will drop <laughs> some leather or something. No, they're just dropping like sticks. Some more goblins, all right. Nope, attack. Actually, quite a few goblins here. This may not be the best idea I got going, but my health seems to be holding up. Where are you going, dude? Oh, wait. Uh, yeah, you brought me to all your friends. I see what you did. I'm only taking two damage, so that uh, defense ability I took late, uh, earlier is kind of helping me out here. But this should help me level up a little bit. Raw meat, we'll take that. A lot of sticks. All right, don't care. All right, I need to watch my health now. Right, so where we were on our way over here, forest mask. What the heck is that? Armor. It gives me armor and damage protection. Looks like I can put that there. <laughs> uh, are the antlers helping me out? Hopefully. All right, cows, uh, you're in there. Well, the only way I can get in there is use my axe and beat my way in there. I'll tell you what, I'm going to go around a little bit. Actually, I probably should almost go back home because my health is getting kind of low. Um, did I grab that steak? I don't think I did. I think my inventory is full and I forgot to grab it. Um, I'm going to see if I can get some leather. Back at home, if we can call it that, because I don't have a house or a bed yet, but we're going to have to call it home. You know what it would help me if I do? If I come here and actually read how actually how to do some things. So, leather, I clicked on it, and can be produced in the following constructions. A tannery, which I thought I couldn't build until I did tailoring, but... Um, so, I'm like, ah, oh, come on, that's, that's a vicious circle. But no, we can make a tannery. Uh, so, I got sticks, I got rope, and I made a jug. Let's go ahead and build ourselves a tannery. Uh... Um, like I said, we can move things around later on once we start finding out where we need to put some things. So I'm guessing I'm just going to throw some pelt on here. And we will get ourselves some leather, which would be nice. And then we can do some tailoring, hopefully, here later on. So the one thing I am doing a lot of is inventory management 101. And it's taking a lot. I, 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 need, I need to find some, like, bamboo and such. Uh, leather... Uh, Pell, let's go ahead and craft that. So it only takes like 20 seconds. That's not too bad. What is this over here? Garbage. So I don't know what I threw down here, but now that turned into garbage. Um, I don't, is it, I have no idea what's turning into garbage. What did I throw there? I don't know. I do not know, but, uh, our first piece of leather is almost done. I did kill a cow, by the way. Got it, I got it pinned down, um, down by the, the water line. It couldn't go anywhere. Let's go ahead and craft. Do I want to do 14? No, let's not do 14. I need some of those. We'll go ahead and craft 10 of those. Now we'll come over to here. And tailoring. Uh, let's go ahead and discover that. Is that going to take a while or... 
Okay, I wasn't close enough to the table. Go figure. All right, so what are we going to learn by doing some tailoring? Hopefully, we can give ourselves some clothing, some better armor. Um, I may need, need to make another seed bed to start planting some cotton because I'm guessing that's going to be kind of crucial for us. Discover some tailoring. Yes, we did. Uh, tailoring table, which is logs, sticks, and rope. Well, um, I do have 15 logs, sticks. I don't have enough sticks and some rope. I'm down on rope. Well, like I said, I uh, gotta keep making some things. Uh, let me go ahead and craft up some more things. Uh, luckily, like I said, we got seed beds over here. And uh, I'll bring you back when I start making the tailoring table. We can find out what we need to do or make or craft. Whatever. Well, that didn't take too long to get ourselves materials for a tailoring table. The question is, where are we going to put it? It's getting a little messy around here, but um, like I said, we'll straighten out soon once we get uh, some things squared away. I don't know where the front or side of this is, but we'll go ahead and put that right on next to our coal smoker. I do need to make... I, I, need, I need to make a lot of big inventory. I need to find the bamboo and ferns, was it? And usually you used to find that along the coast in, in the regular force of nature, so I gotta find some of that stuff. And bamboo, that may be something that uh, takes me a while to find. Other than that, I'm gonna need to make some nails, which is gonna be probably into blacksmithing somehow. But tailoring is definitely gonna help us out, hopefully give me some armor. Although I, I was doing rather well um, killing all those creatures. All right, so wood button. Does it say what the wood button actually does? It doesn't say. Um, oh, I need buttons to make boots. It gives me armor and health, all right, as we thought it would. So this needs pelt, leather, wood buttons, and rope. So it looks like I'm going to be making a lot of buttons. Everything requires buttons. A basket, inventory size is plus four. Five. Well, that would help us out. A sleeping bag. Use a sleeping bag to sleep until morning slash evening or respawn all creatures. I, I Yeah, we don't want to do that. Um, definitely don't want to do that. Let's get some buttons going here. Uh, that just requires sticks. Oh, I need to make a knife. All right. Uh, stone knife is... I need rope. Well... Let's come over here. Yeah, I ran out of some linen seeds. I got tons of linen seeds over my storage area, but you know, I was over here and yeah. Uh, I'm out of water now too. All right, perfect. Uh, let's come over here and we'll grab some water. Now on the jug in the first episode, um, I thought it only held like two water. Just let it keep on going. It actually can hold up to 20 water and every time you dip it in, you're getting two raw water. So just fill up your jug until it's up to 20. I kept doing it was only up to two, and I didn't realize it stacked up to 20, because, well, as we all know, I'm, a, I'm an idiot. All right, we are good there. Let's go back up to here. And we should be going ahead and plant uh, linens, plant all those. We are good. Uh, oh, sorry, got to make a knife, which I mean I need rope. So craft those up. I got flint on me, I believe, or splinters. Is that what they're called? Yeah, splinter. Okay. Uh, yep, stone knife. Let's go ahead and craft that. Then we'll head over to our tailoring table. And start processing some wonderful, wonderful wood buttons. Uh, knife needs to go into here. Tools. Perfect. Do I need to stay here to craft those up? Looks like I do, so it's not like an automaticing, automaticing, automatic um, crafting, which it would be for like purifying water. Yeah, keep making those buttons there, dude. All right, let's see. What can I make off right away? Right now, I just got sneakers. Um, doesn't really say what it does. Three armor, two health. I need leather and rope. Well, we should have a whole bunch of leather here. 
And we are rope. I'm just constantly out of rope. I'm going to go ahead and make some rope. We're going to at least make a little bit of armor before we end the episode. But uh, let me go ahead and get some more materials, which is the name of the game early on. And uh, yeah, we'll make some we'll make some armor for us. That way, next episode, we can venture a little bit further out into the wilderness. Uh, we'll be able to take some hits better, do some killing. Um, by the way, I did actually, on the trap, I actually did trap a goose. Um, but I can't tame it and bring it back. You actually have to build, in the, in the original Force of Nature, you could tame them and bring them back without having an area to put them in. But now we definitely need to build, if we go into building, yeah, you need to build them that are housed first. So I'll have to look into that, uh, maybe what we want to do first. But like I said, that might be next episode. Let me gather up some materials and I'll bring it back. All right, I should have all the material I need to make something. Uh, let's see here. Skin boots, which give me three armor, seven health. That gives me armor, health, and stamina. Light skin pants. Let's go with light skin pants. That gives me armor, health, and stamina. Let's go ahead and craft those up. Not close enough. There we go. So if I open up my inventory right now, it's got jeans on. Can I just throw the jeans on the ground? There we go. I remember the first Force of Nature, there was a trash can that we could put stuff in. So uh, right over here, I dropped down soil, clay, and dirt. And the splinters, which is made by rock. I'm putting down material I know I can easily get. So uh, some stuff is turning into garbage. I don't know what stuff is and what isn't. I forgot what I threw there, but that turned into garbage. So I guess it'll stay there. Um, I do want to make some more inventory. That's for darn sure. All right, we'll grab those and we'll put our pants on. There we go. Taking the jeans off in the hot weather is probably a good idea. So now we got a little bit more armor, health, and stamina. Uh, can I make anything else? No, I'm out of uh, wooden buttons and rope. So I think I'll need to work on that next episode for sure. Uh, but let's go into, do I want to do a barn? Barn is barn is for suitable for all animals. So that just requires logs. Places for animals, one. If I do a cow shed, place for animals three. Sheepfold, goosery. Goose is going to give me feathers, I would assume. And feathers are going to be important because I can make, I do believe I can, where, where did I see that? Where's the bow and arrow? Is that in my crafting, crafting table? It is not. May have to make some shields. Where is the bow? In it? Oh, oh, there we go. So the bow is just a stick and some and and some rope, which is not a problem. Uh, but the arrows, stone arrows, splinters, we can get a lot of sticks. We can get a lot of. I need feathers. So what do I need to do to make a goosery here? Uh, I need rope, sticks, and logs. You know what? I think that's how we'll end the episode. Let me get the materials for that. We'll build a goosery, and then that way, next episode, at least we'll have something to... We'll have to go find some geese and go ahead and take care of the geese, bring them back so I can start getting some feathers and getting myself a nice little bow and arrow. Well, that didn't take too long. Got the materials to go ahead and build a goosery. The question is, where do I want to build it? Um, hopefully, I can move this later on as well. So, I guess right now... Let's see. What does it look like here? All right, you know what, let's go ahead and place that down right up there. How about that? Yeah, go ahead and build our goosery and hopefully we can catch or, capture some goose or geese next episode and we'll put them in here and start gathering us some feathers. I wonder what it is I need to feed the geese with. If it's wheat, it's not a problem. But our little home is becoming a home. So they're building up some things. Uh, I think we doubled the material, not material, but the construction areas we have since the first episode. That's pretty darn good. We leveled up a couple times, put some points into health, stamina, a little bit into blocking, and now we're building some armory. So I'll have to get some more sticks, build some more wooden buttons. All right, so if I come into here, 
Suitable only for geese. More info. Um, is it any kind of geese or just a goose? Because there are different kinds of geese out in the wilderness. So I'll have to go ahead and check on that later on. Let me disarm that. Uh, but yes, definitely, I think before we go out, I want to go ahead and get some, myself some buttons because I definitely want to get some uh, uh, van braces going because I don't have anything in that slot right there. Probably change out my t-shirt as well. Skin coat gives me health and armor. Light skin coat? Yeah, light skin coat. I need buttons and rope. So I'm going to be working on some buttons and rope in between episodes. And we'll get ourselves a whole bunch of armor. That way when we go, I can last a little bit longer in the wilderness. Um, I'll probably also get enough rope to build myself some more storage. Because, yeah, that can only hold five. But until we can find... Uh, where is it? Bamboo. So I got to find bamboo and palm leaves. I got to find that material. Because that will hold... That gives me 18 slots, which seems like a lot. Which is three times more than this. But overall, not too bad. But anyways, that's going to do it for today, guys. Hopefully you guys did enjoy the episode. I do appreciate you watching as always. And I'll catch you again right here in Force of Nature 2. But until then, have a good one.